I waited patiently for the Lord, and he turned to me and heard my cry for help. He brought me up from a desolate pit out of the muddy clay and set my feet on a rock, making my steps secure. He put a new song in my mouth, a hymn of praise to our God. Many will see and fear, and they will trust in the Lord. How happy is anyone who has put his trust in the Lord and has not turned the proud, turned to the proud or to those who have run after lies. Lord my God, you have done many things. Your wondrous works and your plans for us, none can compare with you. If I were to report and speak of them, they are more than I could be to- than can be told. You do not delight in sacrifice and offering. You open up my ears to listen. You do not ask for a whole burnt offering or a sin offering. Then I said, See, I have come in the scroll it is written about me. I delight to do your will, my God, and your instruction is deep within me. I proclaim righteousness in the great assembly. See, I do not keep my mouth closed, as you know, Lord. I did not hide your righteousness in my heart. I spoke about your faithfulness and salvation. I did not conceal your constant love and truth from the great assembly. Lord, you do not withhold your compassion from me. Your constant love and truth will always guard me. For troubles without number have surrounded me. My iniquities have overtaken me. I am unable to see. They are more than the hairs of my head, and my courage leaves me. Lord, be pleased to rescue me. Hurry to help me, Lord. Let those who intend to take my life be disgraced and confounded. Let those who wish me harm be turned back and humiliated. Let those who say to me, Aha! be appalled because of their shame. Let all who seek you rejoice and be glad in you. Let those who love your salvation continually say, The Lord is great. I am oppressed and needy. May the Lord think of me. You are my helper and my deliverer. My God, do not delay.